In this case, we're going to balance our process by a specific tack time. Tack time, of course, is driven by the uh, demand on your on your uh, particular line here. So what you do is you go to your summary, you go to the balance work here, and then you select the option tack time. Now, when you click on it here, you'll see, based upon the current process you see in the background, it's picking the highest station and saying that's your current cycle time. And that's going to allow you to get about 62 units an hour here. And you can see my current cycle time here is about 57. So what I want to do is I want to base my new attack time. Let's say things are going well and the production recalls for a, a higher rate. So maybe we're looking at like a, a 43 second attack time. How many people do we need? So we can come in here, we click on attack time and we say give us 43. And the unit of measure here, the seconds, this will either be seconds, minutes, or hours, depending on your uh, the time units you select uh, to run your balancing with. So I'm working in seconds. I click on this. I say balance. It tells me I need nine operators. And here you can see it's given me some options. My nine operators here are going to be just under 80% utilized and give me about uh, 84 units here. But you can see nine, the same nine operators can go all the way up here all the way up to give me 92. That's a, bit of a substantial difference here. They're far more better utilized here. Or you can go down, you might go down the way and look at where you can get eight operators. Eight operators are going to give you 81 right, production per hour. So uh, you can decide which one you want to go with. Uh, the default will be, if you click on it, balance, it will always find exactly the one you're looking for. So in other words, the tack time that you're looking for is 43 seconds here. And um, so you can then decide whether you want to go with that. You might want to try and run with eight uh, to get, see if you can make the production schedule as well here. So if we want to go with this, we just click on the details and click on the save. It will reorganize it into the, uh, into the nine stations here.